Welcome guys to the oil manager in which we will learn how to characterize oils, crude oils, petroleum acids and so on. And we have three sections right here. Three. Number one is step number one in which we will learn how to input the relevant data, how to add bulk properties, how to add distillation curves, the type of assays we have and maybe even molecular weight, viscosity curves and density curves. All data that is relevant for our crude oil will be inputted here. Then we will calculate all the properties and then we continue with step number two, which is cutting and blending. First, cutting is nothing more than cutting into the soda components. Of course, we are going to have some, let's say, standards or some uh, specific ranges, maybe auto cutting by Aspen Heises, or maybe we as users selecting the ranges. And then we continue with the blending. Blending is nothing more than mixturing or blending two crude oils or more. Then we continue with step number three, which is installing the oil. That is nothing more than selecting which oil or which blend we want installed in our flow sheet. And finally, we will be able to work in the simulation environment. We will be able to work with this oil as we are used to, for instance, we can add temperature, pressure, flow rate to this oil, install oil. And that's what I wanted to know, uh, let you know, guys. But you are probably wondering why do we have an oil manager and a petroleum manager? Essentially, it's the type of uh, license you have. The crude, crude oil uh, license, which is the, let's say, standard license, will have the oil manager. But if you have the petroleum refinery license, which is a little bit more of advanced license, you will have the petroleum assay manager, which we have been working already. So it's, I really think it's very important that if you have both of them, learn how to uh, differ, differ them, how you can convert always oil manager to petroleum assays. Petroleum assays cannot be converted to the oil manager because petroleum assay is, let's say, a, a higher characterization. So typically you can convert something of very minimal to a very uh, high characterization. And well, that's what I want to let you know, guys. So whatever question you have, you know that you can always reach me in the discussion board or the comments or direct message or via email. So yeah, that was everything for the oil manager. It might seem a little bit complicated, but it is not. It's really, really happy and easy and you will enjoy it. You just need to have the data. Actually, in real life, you are going to have problems with the data, not with the input of the data.